Hey, got a customer here looking to replace furnace only. So we got a 40 inch tall furnace, 17 and a half wide. Wants to keep AC system for now, didn't have many issues with it. We'll get rid of the humidifier. Just patch that hole. Uh, we're going to do a new flue T, so a new 5x4x3 by by T is going to go in place here and then make sure we flash around everything. And then put a new 4 inch pipe and rework the 3 inch back into there. Uh, we're going to do a new return drop going up to the, the joist there. That one's only 22 inches wide, so we'll probably take it to 26. And then we might have to kind of rework where the the furnace is because I can't go any wider that way because whoever put the water heater in slammed it right up against there. Uh, gas line. Have to rework. Probably going to have to do something different with the way that the water heater is tied in and to be able to get a shut off on the outside in Union. Electric goes up. Um, currently there's only one return, so we're going to have to add a return to the basement. So I was looking to add them in two different spots. I'm either going to do a larger one there. I'm just kind of hard with uh, the shelving and everything that's in place. Or I was looking to do there, but the paneling's already coming off the wall on the other side. So I'm looking to possibly do one right there, and then one on this side. Uh, the guy's currently has a broken foot, so he can't get down the stairs to move anything. So we're gonna have to move our shelving here to get everything in place that we need to. I told him we'd help him out. Now, uh, no walkouts. We'll have to go up and down the stairs. We're gonna be putting in a Honeywell uh, Vision Pro with the interface module, so that we can control the two stage and he's going to add the humidifier down the road. So here's the other side of that wall. You can actually see the hole if you're looking down on the other side of that ping pong table. Um, so I was just looking to add it somewhere along this wall here. So we'll probably do one in here, smaller one, and then do another one over here behind this wall here. You can actually see because right there where that's leaning up against the Golf clubs are on the other side, which you can see. Which are right there. So, I just plan on doing one there and then one here. There's that hole that you can see. Oh, and then we'll take both of those and then just run them back to the return and tie them into the drop. So that one will just come up and around. Same thing for that one. We'll just keep it up as high as we can. Go around, tie into the ceiling. Or tie into the drop, sorry. Uh, kind of tight space to get through here, but there is plenty of room. We got about 23 inches there, and you got about 27 in between here. So plenty of room to, to get everything out. Uh, no combustion grills because they don't have a door or anything. They're just using a rod with a curtain on it. Good luck.